Here I am again with the HDC Hero and um, I just wanted to show you a few of the apps that I've downloaded from um, the Google Market here. All of these apps are completely free um, and I'm going to show you the ones that I've put on. first one is called um, Astro and it's a file manager and with this you can use, um, you can sort of navigate around your phone up and down like that and uh, we can select lots of folders or files at once if you want like that and then we can press uh, menu and sort of edit them select all create a zip file if you want out of it um, we can also press and hold down on one file and we can send it via an email so if I press send that just shoots it off as an email as you can see there and you put your subject and who it's to um, let's just discard that one um, we can also edit and we can move the file or copy it or delete it um, we can also use if I press menu and application manager these apps that I've downloaded I can back them up so I've got a backed up apps here I've only backed up three of them so far but if I want to back up the apps so that if I do um, have problems with the phone and need to reset it I can reinstall all these apps easily um, through the SD card so if I choose quick and then I choose uh, backup it backs it up to the SD card like that and then that shows on there so that is um, the first application I wanted to show you uh, so that was Astro it's quite a good little file manager second one is called Wikitude and this is a quite a cool little application I'm just going to hide, hide my location here on the bottom let's just uh, take the phone away for a moment and what that will do is it finds um, points of interest near your current location and it shows it up on the camera here so you can see I've got the camera showing if I hold it up um, like that you should be able to see in the distance you see those green things there in the distance those are possible points of interest in your local area so if you're looking for something um, in particular here we can see the boat in so let's choose that one and you can see a bit of detail about the boat in here let's just go back onto the nice stationary table and you can see um, just looks like just another pub uh, and it gives you a little review about the pub so if you're looking for someone somewhere uh, to go for a drink or if you're looking for a hotel and Wikitude is a great little application and uses the uh, GPS and the compass um, system very well indeed um, again that is free uh, the third app I wanted to show you is called a locale which is here and you can see here I can create an, a situation locale actually lets you manage your phone depending on your location or um, your uh, the time of day or m much more of the conditions so I'm going to create one called test uh, I'm going to create a situation called test rather uh, and then down here I'm going to say at a certain time so let's create a one that starts at midnight and ends at 7 a.m. every day and I'm going to say between those times I want you to and I'll go down here to add settings there's a volume control I want you to turn the volume control completely off so that's a cool little um, one just created so that one's called test and um, I can now be safe in the knowledge that it will um, turn down the volume when I'm um, asleep. And you can do other things, like you can tell it to, um, if I go to setting, you can tell it to turn your Wi-Fi off. And it can do that um, based on your location, it doesn't have to be time. You can also set it to on a certain date or when the battery gets to a certain level. You can tell it to turn the Wi-Fi off, or you can tell it to um, change the display brightness, perhaps. Um, 
uh, you can send a certain tweet, you can do lots of other things, there's various plugins as well for Locale um, that's a great little application I've also got here on the left we've got Shazam which as you might know is the um, uh, music identification service, you just sort of hold it up in front of a, a, a tune that's playing and it'll tell you exactly what it is we've got Quick which is a, a sort of um, video broadcasting service or sort of send your uh, whatever your camera's pointing at onto the web so I'll just show you that and I can literally press this button here and it will send it online and you can record um, or sort of broadcast live TV from your Android phone so that's quick uh, what else have I got here that I've forgotten about uh, Google Talk on there there's Tita, so I'll look over here. Oh yes, that um, I've got Tone Picker as well, which I think is a fantastic little app here. It will let you not only choose normal sort of tones for your ringtone, you can adjust various things like ringer volume, music volume, the call volume, the system sound volume, the alarm volume. You can also change the default ringtone here you can see it kind of breaks the HTC Heroes Sense experience slightly. It asks you for some of these prompts. So I'm going to say, um, use the tone picker, please. And with the tone picker, you can choose uh, a music track, say an MP3 that you've got on on this phone. Um, so I'm going to choose that, and I'm going to say, let's choose an MP3 that I've uploaded. And we've got loads here, so um, I'm going to choose this rave anthems. So that'll do, that'll do as my ringtone. And we've also got default notifications as well. And again, we can choose uh, a music track for that or use a tone picker. And you can choose one of the tones that are on um, on the phone. So you've got loads of different options there. Or you can use the Android system to choose one of the ringtones that are sort of installed as default on the phone. So I've got silent at the minute. But we... Let's have that one. Um, so I think Tone Picker is a fantastic little addition as well and pretty much that is it so far that I've installed on the phone if you have any other suggestions uh, do let me know I think Astro's really cool other bits that I've got on here um, Shop Savvy as well which is a cool little application um, which I've installed it basically lets you scan a product so if I just hold you there just two seconds if I choose scan a product and I just twist the phone round you'll see it loading up my camera now and you'll get a little red line look at that it's a scanner barcode now I've got some um, a product here and there's the barcode you hold the camera, let's just try this, over the top of the barcode. And then it says here, look, that is some Foster's Lager you've chosen there, which is great, yes it is. And it will tell you basically where it can be um, purchased cheaper, and you can get reviews and stuff like that. So I think, uh, you know, it, as this evolves, it'll be... Uh, fantastic, I mean alert me when the price reaches a certain level, stuff like that. Uh, there's no picture of the Foster's Lager here unfortunately, but you can do that with um, a range of uh, products and when you're down to your local supermarket, hopefully you'll be able to just kind of hold the phone up against the product and scan it. And then you can basically see if it's it's available cheaper anywhere else. As simple as that. So those are the apps that I've got on my Hero. And uh, if you've got some apps that uh, you feel are um, worth putting on to uh, an Android phone uh, or even a Windows mobile phone, let me know. And we'll include them on another video or put them on the website.